Sports from KYMA News 11. Imperial Tigers softball is ready to make a big splash into the CIF San Diego Section Division III playoffs. Welcome back, everyone. Imperial is coming off a second place finish in the Desert League with hopes of elevating their game for a potential run at the D3 title. They would host Canyon Hills at Abdul Muhammad Field for this afternoon's playing game. Spirited Tigers are led by Jaden Rutledge, who gets to start on the hill. Top first with a runner on first. Rutledge would give up a deep drive to left over the head of Brianna Meza as the base runner rounds third. And then just moments after that, she's going to make the slide to home plate unchallenged. The Tigers down 2 nothing. Ouch! Rutledge would refocus, though, getting Lynette Dedumbra to strike out for the second out of the inning. Then she forces a grounder to Hannah Johnson, who rockets her throw to first to end the top half with Imperial in an early 2 to nothing hole. But the Tigers' offense would quickly respond in the bottom half. Enter Hannah Johnson, drilling this offering up to center field gap. She's going to round first. And because of a Rattler's fielding error, blowing past second and getting herself a leadoff triple. Talk about a momentum swing. Next batter, Andrea De La Trinidad capitalizes, delivering a deep fly to left as Johnson tags third, easily beating out the throw to home plate. The Tigers cutting the early deficit in half. This would turn into an offensive slugfest. The Tigers would actually have to rally from six runs down, but they would edge Canyon Hills by the slimmest of margins, eight to seven. They next pay a visit to top-seeded Holtville in the first round of the Division Three bracket on Thursday. That'll be a good one. All right, we move on to Northern Imperial County for Division Five play and softball game between Castle Park and five-seeded Calipatria. Top of the fifth, or first, excuse me, Hornets' Francesca Salcida in the circle with two outs, and she gets it for the first base hit. Next batter, Francesca with another comebacker. To her left, this one she can handle and flips it to first to end the inning. So to the home half of the first. Hornets leadoff batter Kylie Liverly takes an inside pitch for a ball four and works her way for a walk. And then it's Kimberly Gamboa for the Hornets and she sends a high fly, high fly ball in the shallow right center. Liverly was going to hustle the third. Hornets with runners in the corners just like that. Hornets looking good and Luz Aguiar with his hot shot up the middle here. There it is right there. And the mishandling of the ball is going to allow another runner to score. That's going to open up the floodgates. Calipatria rolls it home by the score of 21 to 5. That's a football score. The Hornets next head on the road to face Mount Miguel on Wednesday. We stay on the Hornets campus for the CIF Division 5 baseball matchup between 11-seeded Hoover and 6-seeded Calipatria. So we go to the top of the second. Two outs. Hornets down 1-0. Diego... Amil gets the batter to swing at strike. At the strike in the dirt, catcher Zachary Leal tossing the first to Diego Moreno for the third out. Home half of the second. It's Diego Romero at the plate. He puts a jolt into this pitch into deep right, getting it done. A runner's going to score here. And Calipatria looking like they're in business. Then it's a pitcher versus pitcher matchup. Diego Amilal gets swinging, and swinging he gets. And there's a wild pitch right there. And the floodgates would continue to open here. Calipatria would take the win over Hoover. Seven to two. And finally, Division IV's play in. Calexico playing host to High Tech High Chula Vista. We go to the bottom of the fourth. Bulldogs, Jose Munoz is going to ground the third. He isn't able to beat out the throw as the base runner remains at third base. And then the next Bulldog batter falls victim to the proverbial strikeout as the fourth inning comes to a close. Top of the fifth, Colexico forces a ground out to third, and the Dogs, quick-like, retire the side. Moving quickly to the bottom half, Armando Wu exercising some discipline at the plate. You got yourself a bases-loaded walk, bases full of dogs. Then, Leo Valise is going to ground this pitch coming up to, third, to the third baseman, the throw's going to get home on time, but the catcher mishandles the ball as Andre Valdez manages to somehow get by him and get to the home plate before the catcher can get the ball. 12-1. to 1, The Dogs win and the convincer advancing to the first round of the Division IV tournament. All right, guys, that's going to do it for the CIF San Diego Division baseball softball highlight round of sports. We'll send it back to you.